I was raised in a household with seven children. I was the eldest child. My mother was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy and from then on her health started deteriorating. She started losing the ability to walk. Um, she went from being a stay-at-home mom. Uh, she was the one who took care of us while my father went to work and she couldn't do that. So basically when I was 13 years old, I um, became like a little mother to my brothers and sisters. Um, I would take care of them, make sure they were fed, put them to sleep, uh, make sure they had clothes. I used to clean the house and of course my mother take care of her. From there everything just started getting worse and um, you know, we're seven children, I was the oldest, and we're all really young. I tried at first to go to school. Towards the end, I, uh, I kind of start, started dropping out, not taking classes, not to, going to tests. And then finally she passed away. Um, I think that was the hardest part, where just I found myself with emptiness, little by little, and I just started losing weight and losing weight and losing weight. And the more I lost weight, the more depressed, depressed I came. And then one day, a social worker just came in and he told us about Emuna in the dormitory. We felt that it was, the best decision was for me to um, move in the dormitory with my siblings. They welcomed me with open arms. They were prepared for everything I needed. They knew I was coming. Um, all the staff here just were really amazing. Uh, I felt really at home. I finally had everything I didn't get at home. I had hope with school. I was treated with my eating disorder. I had staff members, the Madricha, that supported me with everything I needed. Clothes, food, anything. Anything that you would get in a household and probably even more. Two months after I came here, I was already enrolled in school and I started learning. I had a tremendous amount of support. And yeah, today, 20 years old, two years after, and I finished with a pretty, pretty good average. <laughs> a really good and excellent average. It feels like an amazing accomplishment, something I wouldn't have dreamed of at home. After I graduated high school, I went to volunteer as part of national service at MDA. Working at Magenda Vida Dome gives me a chance to give back to the community. Feels, it feels really good, it feels satisfying. This place taught me to dream, and if I worked hard, then I can live that dream one day. My dream is to become a doctor, to get into medical school. Today I'm already independent and um, I have my whole life in front of me, but I still have a few little siblings that are in Amuna and it keeps me calm to know that they are in good hands and they also have a bright future in front of them thanks to Amuna. It's really humbling to think that there are Jews all over the world that don't even know us. They don't, they have never met us. They don't, some of them don't even know our stories. And yet they support us and they care for us. And yeah, it's, it's amazing. Yeah.